Hi friends, welcome. Friends, this is the question from 2008 question paper and it was for 2 marks. Here, question is, a hollow enclosure is formed between two infinitely long concentric cylinders of radii 1 meter and 2 meter respectively. Radiative heat exchange takes place between the inner surface of larger cylinders, that is surface 2, and the outer surface of the smaller cylinder, that is surface 1. The radiating surface are diffuse and the medium in the enclosure is non-participating. The fraction of the thermal radiation leaving the larger surface and striking itself is. Here we have to find out that is. See first here friends, this is our diagram. Here in this diagram, this is the larger cylinder and here this is the surface 2 that is inside surface of the larger cylinder which is in concave shape and here this is our smaller cylinder and this the, the surface and here it is a surface 1 which is the outer surface of the a smaller cylinder which is convex here and here friends as you can see the fraction of the thermal radiation leaving the larger surface and striking itself means here we have to find out f22 okay so here friends we have r1 radii 1 r1 we have here 1 meter and r2 we have here 2 meter okay so now here friends for surface we will take first for surface 1 that is this surface smaller cylinder surface here f11 plus f12 is equal to 1 here friends as you can see in this is the convex surface of smaller cylinder that is surface 1 so here for convex and flat surfaces f11 that is here the shape factor of surface 1 with itself is always 0 for flat and convex surface as one cannot see or view any other part of the same surface so now and here this is f12 so here we will left with f12 is equal to 1 that is shape factor of surface 1 with respect to surface 2 now here friends for we will for we will apply here now reciprocity theorem so by recip reciprocity theorem reciprocity theorem is here a1 f 1 2 is equal to a a 2 f 2 1 so now let's put the values so here a 1 is 2 pi r r 1 2 pi r 1 in r 1 into l length of the cylinder into we have f 1 2 is equal to here we have now a 2 is 2 pi r 2 l into f 2 1 ok now let us put the values here we have uh, f 1 2 is 1 so here we left with r 1 is equal to r 2 is equal into we have f 2 1 so here we have now f 2 1 is equal to r1 upon r2 so here we have r1 1 and r2 is 2 so here we left with 0 0.5 so here we have f21 is equal to 0 0.5 okay f21 we have 0 0.5 so now we will take surface for surface 2 here we have now f22 that is shape factor of surface 2 with respect to itself plus f21 is equal to 1 we have and f21 is shape factor of surface 2 with respect to 1 so now let's put the values in the equation so here we have f22 
plus f to 1 we have 0 0.5 which is equal to 1 so here f to 2 is equal to 0 0.5 this is our answer okay that is here the fraction of thermal radiation leaving the larger surface and striking itself that is f22 is 0.5 that is option b is the correct answer for this question thank you friends for watching this video like share and comment for this video and subscribe my channel thank you